What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, today I am recording this last minute. I didn't have a video to post for tomorrow, but I've been meaning to make this video uh, for a while now. So I thought I'd just quickly make, make it right now. And today we're going to be talking about uh, this GoPro case that I have. Uh, this is a metal GoPro case. It is very durable uh, and uh, I think that it's totally worth it to add a little extra weight to your drone and uh, not stick your precious little GoPro into a TPU mount where it's uh, just going to get screwed up and probably broken depending on how hard you crash. But let me tell you, with these cases, uh, I have two of them here, and uh, I've crashed this one quite a few times on this drone, and it's uh, a little scuffed up here and stuff, but the GoPro has always walked away from the crash with no problem, and so I thought that I would share this with you guys, because in my opinion, instead of paying hundreds of dollars for insurance for your GoPro, if you go with a case like this, and you don't mind the extra weight on your drone, I think you're gonna be pretty happy with uh, a cheap solution to not always breaking your GoPro. Now, obviously, this is not a guarantee. You could still break your GoPro while using this case, but this is gonna be way better than any of your TPU mounts. So, uh, yeah, let's just kind of take a closer look at it. So, uh, here I have the blue one, here I have a black one. They are exactly the same. So you take the GoPro, you put it in here like so, and then there's this little back cover plate that you slide on, and then it clips on right here. And that's pretty much it. You have a cover here you could take off to open up the lens, and then also these come off and you can get ND filters in this style and screw them on very quick and interchangeable. It comes with your traditional uh, GoPro style mount uh, for the one that's on my drone as you can see I actually took that piece off and I'm running a fixed angle here I uh, created a special TPU mount here that the GoPro case screws onto the TPU at a fixed angle and then of course it goes on to the frame um, one thing I want to mention is if you do get this case uh, this cover uh, I only have this one from the black one, the one from the blue one I actually lost while flying. I don't know if it happened because I crashed or if it just came off during flight from the vibrations. Uh, but what I did was I created this little print here. So from TPU I printed this, which is a great little piece that will prevent this back door from opening up. So what you do is you just slide it into right here, into this opening. And you slide in the TPU all the way in. And once it's all the way in, it will prevent this back door from coming up and opening up. So it won't come off during flight. Oh, accidentally click record. It won't come off during flight and uh, you won't lose your GoPro, which is definitely what you want. So yeah, I believe this is the best cheap solution to protect your GoPro if you don't mind adding some extra weight. Um, they are going to be a little heavy, the fully metal, uh, but I definitely think it's worth it. Uh, you can try to fly it with the um, traditional GoPro mount style where you can change the angle. But I notice that when I fly around because the case is heavier itself, it does tend to move a little bit and it's very hard to get a fixed angle in there and keep it there. That's why I decided to remove that and just use a TPU print like this and mount it in a fixed angle so it doesn't have the ability to, um, to move. So that's pretty much it. I want to keep this quick, uh, short little video. Just wanted to put it out there uh, for those of you that don't want to spend a whole bunch of money on... Uh, insurance for your uh, GoPro. This is probably the best solution for this. Uh, and I uh, know the like GoPro 9 and 10, they have a, uh, a larger form factor, so it won't fit in these cases, but I'm more than certain that they do make cases like this for the bigger GoPros. Uh, so that's that. Uh, anything else? Not much else to say about these. I mean, pretty simple. Uh, but they do work great, so um, 
If you guys end up using them, let me know if you like it or not. And that's it for today. So thanks for watching. Please throw me a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Mm -hmm.